and I'm here today to answer the question how does media and information literacy affect me personally, socially, and professionally? Media and information literacy have become prominent parts of life for many young people today. As time goes by, we have the so-called globalization and constantly rising and developing our technology. Most people engage with technology without stopping to think what effects are on our lives, whether positive or negative. How does it should affect us personally, socially, and professionally? Media and information literacy has had a positive impact. We are living in a time where the world is open to us. We can contact anyone around the world at any time with just few key strokes. We can also share elements of our life, from what we enjoy to photos of ourselves. It's like being a part of the person's world, even though distance keeps us apart. As a student, it gives us great resources, new opportunities for learning, ways to collaborate and create, and save money. It is a very powerful tool for education and makes our lives easier. Media neglect the fact that it has reduced the real-world communication to the minimum and this affects the real-life relationship badly. People spend more hours in popular social media sites and should make sure that they are giving equal attention to the relationship in the real world. The people who are using technologies are less productive than others. It also affects mental and physical health of people. It causes depression, loneliness, mental illness, and it can also cause addictions. I think that the fact of media and information literacy has been somehow balanced. There are many good things about it and many bad things. We should always remember that we are the one responsible of our own lives. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you!